Welcome to the TR Hiacom YouTube channel, your two-way radio communication source. Hi, I'm Tim Davies, and today I'll be discussing some maintenance and tips for your Impress batteries. This will help ensure you get the most out of your battery life and ensure your two-way radio is operating more efficiently. Firstly, there is a simple check to determine what type of battery you are using. There is a sticker located on the battery that shows the type of battery that it is. Here you will see the battery type and it will clearly state if it is an Impress battery. Determining the battery capacity can be done quite easily when the radio is connected. There are two ways if you are using a radio with a display, and for this demonstration I am using a DP4600. This has a display, and it will show the current charge level on the battery indicator, with a flat battery being represented by one segment. When the battery life is critical, the battery segment indicator will begin to flash. Irrespective of whether your radio has a display or not, when it has detected that the battery charge is low and needs to be replaced soon, there will be an alert tone of two short beeps. These beeps will happen when the radio is completed transmitting, so when you hear these tones, you know the battery is due for a recharge. The benefit of Impress batteries compared to non-Impress is that they don't develop a memory over time. Impress batteries include a chip that logs the charge history, meaning that you get the most out of the life of your battery. A couple of things to remember before you recharge your battery is that it should be flat and use an impress charger, otherwise the chip won't recognise the charge. Also, when placing the battery in the charger and the radio is still connected, make sure the radio is switched off. No matter whether your charger is a single or multi-unit charger, it will use the LED to notify you of the battery's status. If you see an orange light, it means that the battery is being reconditioned. This means that the battery is not flat and will be completely discharged before it is recharged. A flashing orange light means the battery charge is in standby mode and not charging or discharging. This may be due to a few reasons, such as the battery is running too hot or the ambient temperature is too high. Once the battery has cooled down, it will resume. If you see a red light, it means the battery is charging. After approximately one hour, you will reach a trickle charge status. This is identified with a flashing green light. This means your battery is charged to 90% or above. Once the battery is fully charged or 100%, the light will be solid green. This is usually after approximately four hours, depending on the capacity of your battery. If you insert the battery and the charger light is flashing red and green, the charger has detected that the battery is at the end of its service life. It is best to have it checked by your provider if this occurs. A quick workaround should you need to quickly recharge your batteries is to remove and quickly reinsert the battery. It will change it from reconditioning to charge or charge to reconditioning. Do not do this continuously as it will shorten the life of your batteries. We hope you found this information useful today. Be sure to leave us any questions or comments in the comments section below. You can also subscribe to our YouTube channel and our other social media networks using the description below. Thanks for watching.